grandfather, ten generations ago, was from Snowdonia. So I'm going to go to Clemberis, and I hear I have to go to the top, top of uh, Mount Snowdonia, or else I can't say anything else. I think I'm taking the train, though. <laughs> and, and I went to the Brecon Beacons and wandered around. Those were really lovely. And I played in Clentricent, and I had been practicing my Welsh, and I knew that to say cheers was going to be like yaki da or something like that, but I couldn't remember it. So I went up and I said, wacky do! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that worked. <laughs> they laughed too. <laughs> but it made up for the first time I ever played in Wales, which was, oh God, so probably about 30 years ago. And um, I didn't really understand. I didn't know. And so I got up and I said something about, isn't that uh, really some great things your prince is doing these days? <laughs> and everybody kind of sat there, kind of like, <laughs> and they were too kind, you know. But during the break, somebody came and, and set me straight. <laughs> being in Wales is like being in Scotland or Ireland or Cornwall. It's not England. <laughs> well, let's see. Let's do one we can sing. This is a beautiful song. This was written by Cy Con, who. Um, is a contemporary Appalachian songwriter, mostly writes songs about labor, uh, unions, and environmental issues. Um, and, but this is a love song called uh, Wild Rose of the Mountains. And all you have to remember is honey, sugar, and water. Get the chorus. <coughs> Christmas Day at all. 